A muse is an entity, it could be a person, it could be an object, it could be an idea that uh, inspires you creatively. I think that the muse is an image where it accumulates everything that the person can or doesn't want to notice in himself. A muse fills you with passion and inspiration. It's just something or someone that made you feel a catalyst for an artist to express their deepest emotions and craft them into something beautiful. Muse is an astral synthesis of factors, what you can see, but uh, you can feel it. It's a source of inspiration. Muse characterizes inspiration, so she is a physical portrayal of inspiration. She has soft fair skin, strong gentle hands, a winning white big smile, tender voice, elegant flying look, sparkling eyes. Because that's what makes me sparkle. She has really hair, long curly hair. She wears bright makeup. Her posture is uh, graceful and her gaze is calm. She's all about grace and natural beauty because that one makes her unique. And she's definitely taking care of herself, her body and her feelings. For me, appearance doesn't matter. I think that muse, it's not about traditional beauty. There's someone with a really strong presence and unconventional way of thinking. She's full of kindness. Full of love. Full of passion. She's single. Wise. Tender. Confident. Hard to reach. She's brave. Strict. Quite emotional and sensitive. Gentle. Artistic. Alive. She has endless joy for life. She has humor. She's not afraid to try new, and also she's free in her decisions. She's sensual. Mysterious. Difficult to handle sometimes. Difficult to read. I'd say generally imperfect. But she also has an incredible drive. She's stubborn. She's creative. Noble. Aware. Open-minded. Generous. Spiritual. Something that you want to attain. Very independent. Strong. Inspirational. Childlike. Always seeks adventures. Daydreamer. <laughs> she makes you smile even when you want to cry with every little cell of your body. It's a gracious thing, I believe. The news gives the artist a hand with which she wishes as an artist to flesh ideas. Inspires and gives life delight to the creativeness of an artist and his work. In difficult times when an author doesn't know what to write, to draw, to sing. The muse writes and gives some string. Makes you see things from different angles. Makes the artist um, find his or her inspiration, which already lies within them. People. In real life, uh, there was a person uh, that I definitely felt like was my muse. My sister is a muse to me. I think everyone should say that Celia is a muse. My mother has inspired me my entire life. My muse is my mother. It's my girlfriend. My boyfriend. My sister. My friends. Everybody can be a muse. A stranger from a bookshop. A police officer helped you to find your way. Every person you meet. Just to me, a muse is not a person. I think that inspiration lies in everything, if it's touchable or not. The muse is all around you. Things you see around you in the world, in, the, in your daily life. Landscapes, clouds in the sky. The greatness of the mountains. Architecture. Water. In its different stages. Little things. It's the butterflies you get in your stomach. The goals I want to achieve in my future. Old and dusty books. 
on some Samson. The first sip of the coffee in the morning. The first piece. Communications. Experiences. Nature. The literature. Music. Art. The smell of the person I love. The faintly remembered past. Just everything that happens to you. It's like in the air, it's like something you can describe, you know? The muse is beauty, art, bliss, freedom, purpose, yes, comfort, passion, light, joy, love, and just life in general.